Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Manish here. In the last video, I have shown you how to install Google services in the new Huawei Y7P. But unfortunately, that method is not working anymore. So in this video, I will be showing you how to install Google services in Huawei Y7P. This method is applicable for Mate 30 series as well as Huawei Y7P. I will put down the links for each mobile in the description as well as in the comment section below. Before starting the video, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please do subscribe and also press the bell notification. If this video is helpful for you, please click the like button. Also share it with your friends. Let's start the video. For this method, you need a USB flash drive with OTG cable or SD card. Download the zip files from the description and transfer it to the SD card or flash drive whichever you are using. I am using here the SD card. Now open the file manager, go to memory card and long tap on the zip file that you copied to your flash drive. Click on more, extract to, current directory, ok. In this video, I am using the Huawei Y7P. Once the extraction is done, it will take you to the extracted files. Then open the file and you will see two files inside that, namely Google Apps and Huawei. Select both the files and click on move. Go back to the USB drive and now click move. All the files will be moved here. Now. Open settings and go to system and updates. Then click backup and restore. Then click data backup. Then later click on next, agree, external storage, memory card and then you will see a file named 17 October 2019. Click on that and in the next screen keep select all and click on restore. It will ask to enter a password. Enter the same password mentioned in the password tip and then click OK. After that, open file manager and then go to memory card drive. There you will see Google Apps folder. Open the Google Apps folder and there you will find a bunch of apps. Install all the apps one by one. This is how all the apps will be installed on your phone including Play Store. When it is completed, go to the home screen and there you will find a new G icon. Open it and click on activate. Then click allow. Then you will see a blue box. Click the blue box, again another screen will pop up. Press the blue box again. Now the process will start. Once you see first red circle with exclamation, you have to restart the device. Once the device is restarted, you have the Google services installed. Now you can open the Play Store and enter your credentials. There you go, the Play Store is working. Let's try to install WhatsApp. The WhatsApp is working fine. Let me show you YouTube. Voila, it's working fine as well. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Press the bell icon. I will meet you in our next video. Until then, this is Manish signing off.